Ethan, slightly disappointing doubt there for the team today. Yeah, I think really disappointing, um, especially being 2-0 up. Um, second half, you know, I think we was nowhere near at it. Uh, second balls, competing, um, reactions, they were better than us and yes, can't win games if we come out like that. Yeah, Preston seemed to be really happy with their improved performance. Was it almost a bit of a balance where they improved, you guys kind of slipped a bit? Yeah, but um, you know, at half time, we knew what to expect. Um, they're an energetic side, uh, being down as well. We knew they was going to come at us and you know, we should have been prepared for it. Um, I think we started the second half as if maybe the game was already won, but I think in the championship, you know, until that final whistle is gone, teams ain't going to give up and, you know, it cost us today. As a group, you must be disappointed to concede four for the first time in a long time as well. Yeah, exactly. You know, as a team, you know, we've really um, had great pride in our defending and, you know, keeping teams out or conceding as minimum. And, you know, we're really disappointed with the goals today. Um, obviously, one from a set piece, um, giving the ball away and um, second contact, as I mentioned before. So, something that uh, we've got to look at and make sure that, you know, we come a lot better with it next game. Does a result like that motivate you to kind of want to get that out of your system straight away? Yeah, definitely. You know, um, it's still fresh. So, at the moment, the boys are going to be down, disappointed in our performance. But... You know, I think come tomorrow, the next day, you know, we've got to get out of our system and want to want to improve and put that past us and come back uh, ready to go next game. It was a good first half. Can you take positives from that? Yeah, I think first half, you know, um, we stuck to our task well. Um, the two good finishes from Ivan um, played some good football. Um, but obviously, you know, we knew what kind of team they are. Um, we knew that we'd uh, had to battle. Um, I think we matched them well first half, but you know, second half we just let them get on top of us. Does the international break give you a chance to kind of analyse a few things now and more in depth? Um, yeah, it does. But then, you know, on the other hand, you know, it's nice when there is a game kind of sooner, so that you can kind of just go out there and you know prove what we can do and show how we can be better. But yeah, the, we'll look back on it and go through everything and you know, try and digest it and move forward. Obviously, there's a lot of games to come after this international break. Is it almost a chance for you guys to take the rest when it comes as well? Yeah, um, you know, it has been a quick start to the season, obviously, uh, still being in the Carabao Cup as well. So there has been quite a few games. So yeah, I think the boys uh, can use it to just, you know, recompose and reset and get ready, get ready for the rest of the season and then to kick on and go again.